U.S. Attorney General Merrick Garland, on Thursday, May 23, called former President Donald Trump's claims that the FBI was authorized to shoot him during its 2022 search of his Florida club force and extremely dangerous. Garland told reporters that Trump and some of his allies were referring to a standard operations plan that limits when agents can use lethal force while executing search warrants. The FBI searched Trump's Mar-a-Lago resort in August 2022 to retrieve classified material that he retained after leaving office. Agents found a slew of records that led to one of the four criminal prosecutions Trump currently faces. Ahead of the search, the FBI drafted a policy statement, which was made public this week, that authorized law enforcement to use deadly force only if an officer or another person was under immediate threat. Trump was not present when the search took place. Trump, the Republican challenger to Democratic President Joe Biden in the November 5 election, has falsely claimed in fundraising messages sent by his campaign this week that the FBI was authorized to attempt an assassination. Breaking from Trump, Biden's doge was authorized to shoot me, read one email, titled and nearly escaped death. It's just been revealed that Biden's DOJ was authorized to use deadly force for their despicable raid in mar lago Garland, who oversees the FBI as Attorney General, said such policies are routine and will also in effect during consensual searches of Biden's homes conducted by the FBI in a separate classified documents investigation. That allegation is false and it's extremely dangerous, Garland told reporters, during a press conference announcing a lawsuit against the concert promoter Live Nation. The use of false document was among hundreds of pages of records and sealed this week in the criminal case accusing Trump of unlawfully retaining sensitive government documents after leaving the White House in 2021. Trump has pleaded not guilty. His defense team is seeking to suppress evidence seized during the search arguing that it violated Trump's rights under the U.S. Constitution. FBI agents seized about 100 classified documents from mar lago during the court-authorized search, which came after Trump thwarted government demands to return the documents, according to prosecutors.